Hey Doc, what happens if I grind my net wrap while I'm grinding up my hay bales? Well, I'll tell you the first thing that's going to happen. If you grind net wrap, it's going to grind up like the hay you're grinding into itty bitty little pieces. And you'd think those itty bitty little pieces would just pass right on out of the cow. It's not quite that simple. You see, the cow is, has a rumen, and this rumen is always in motion. And that motion of the rumen helps move feed around, so this feed can digest. But all those itty bitty little pieces of net wrap that is in motion in the rumen eventually come into each other, and they lock. These locked up pieces of net wrap find more pieces of net wrap, until it's not just little itty bitty pieces of net wrap, but a big old wad of net wrap. And as the rumen moves that wad of net wrap around, eventually it finds its way to a point where all the feed is supposed to leave the rumen and move to the rest of the digestive system. And it blocks that little area off. Now a couple of different things can happen from here. One is the motion of the rumen against that net wrap ball can wear a hole through the wall of the rumen. That perforation causes the cow to die from sepsis pretty quickly. That's not the most common thing I see, though, with a cow that has a problem with net wrap. The most common problem I see with a cow that has a problem with net wrap is when that ball of net wrap has blocked off that hole so that feed can move through, that cow slowly goes downhill. Sure, she still gets some energy from the volatile fatty acids that are absorbed through the wall of the rumen that the bacteria produce, but she doesn't get everything. Many guys think if they see a cow like this that she's got hardware. It's very similar. They both kind of go downhill. They both don't respond to treatment at all with an antibiotic. However, with hardware, you expect to see a fever. If a cow has a ball of net wrap, that's not as likely. Now, most of the time, people don't realize that this net wrap is actually causing a problem in cows. These cows are usually sold or euthanized before we do a necropsy to see that it was actually a net wrap ball that was causing the problem but it still happens, and on a more frequent basis than I think we give it credit for. So if you want my advice, I would cut that net wrap off before I grind hay. I know it's a real pain and it's a lot of work. However, it makes me feel better when I'm working with my cows to know that I'm putting my best foot forward for them so they can stay as healthy as possible so they'll feed my bottom line. Well, folks, if you have any other questions that come up about beef cattle production, this is a great series for you to like and subscribe to. We put these up every other week in between the videos that we do with our regular shoot site for Doc Jake series. So if you have these video notifications sent to you, you'll get all the different types of questions that you may have about beef cattle production answered. So feel free to hit that like button or subscribe so we can have this information delivered to you in a timely manner.